Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I have a very, very rare video for you. I barely ever go to this shop. Me and mum don't really go to this shop that much. I have a beer and M haul for you guys. So um, I went out with my friend and put them into B and M. So the one near me, I don't, I'm not, I don't really like um, that store. It just gets a little bit hot in there. But the one when we went to Beckles, it just feels more spacious and nice. So we did pop in there. I don't know if I already said. Spent about forty two pound. So yeah, um, my cap is this black uh, nightcap which I bought from ASOS. So yeah, I'm still going along with the no editing thing. So yeah, let me crack on and show you what I picked up from B and M. So first of all, um, I'm absolutely obsessed with Scooby Doo. I love it. As you can see, I'm wearing a Scooby Doo mystery machine top which i got from primark for six quid it's so so cheap then i found out that um b m actually have a um scooby-doo dog um treat selection i couldn't believe it so my brothers uh, my brother and his fiance they have a dog uh, obviously have a dog and his birthday's in september so me and mum we're going to get a little um doggy birthday gifts for him so yeah the scooby-doo range was selling out so so like so so quick only thing they didn't have scooby snacks in there which was a little bit heartbreaking anyway first of all they have these they are the scooby-doo um with real chicken and bacon you get four meaty hot dogs they are so so cool honestly i just had to Get and they were really really good i think they were 99p um two of the items here were 99p one was one pound 14 and i can't remember which one was which and i've lost the receipt so yeah them they are so so cool honestly then these the scooby-doo snacks and they're high in protein for your dog as well they're called scrummy sausages no artificial colors or flavors which import and beef honestly and look scooby at the front they are just so 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 cool it makes me want to get a dog just for the scooby do tree they're so cool and then these are the these are made with 90 percent beef come on scooby do scooby snacks hearty hamburgers and these are high in protein as well made about wheat corn or soy so them they are so 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 cool honestly they're so cool so then, they're the only three uh, doggy bits we picked up. We still got to get a few more bits for him. Then we absolutely love the Lenore um, in-wash scent boosters. So we've literally nearly had so many uh, fragrances now, but we've never had this one. It's the Spring Awakening one. I think they're £2.99 in there. It smells really, really, really good. Literally popping these into our wash, we've actually noticed a huge difference. Like, it smells good anyway with our normal uh, like comforts and all that sort of stuff. But have, having this extra fragrance in there just, honestly, it's so, so, so lovely. Really, really brave, the scent boosters. Then, Mum has been looking at all um, B&M's when she's been to them. Hasn't made to see them. I uh, saw him. It's getting a bit tired because it's quite late at night. I saw him in the one I went to. You get 12 um, ballpoint pens and they are the Paper Mate Ink Joy ones. I, I think they are the Candy Joy one. So I don't know if they do smell of candy or not, but yeah, these, there were two quid in there. This. Um, I got the Moroccan Spice one from Boots, which is amazing. But mum said a lot of people are raving about the Imperial Leather Moon Skies with white cashmere, calming bath. So literally, to be fair, nearly every store selling this now. Tesco have it, Morrison's have it, um, Boots have it, Superdrug have it. So it's like, you can get it from a lot of different stores. So this one, I think it's a pound in there as well. It's really, really cheap. And it does smell absolutely delicious. That is a lovely uh, smell. And it is 500 mils. And then we just quickly grab a drink. This is absolutely beautiful. The R-White Raspberry Lemonade. It's really tasty. 
and I put it in the freezer just to get extra, even more chilled. Then these are so cool. I absolutely love the Ritter chocolate so much. And they are mini bars of them. They are so, so, so cute. They're £1.99 there. Sometimes I fancy a bit chalky, but I don't want to eat the whole bar. And these are perfect. Say if I want a little, you know, sweet treat. They're literally a tiny little, uh, like, cube. So I feel this is the perfect size just to hit my sweet um, tooth. They are really so, so thick, honestly. And you get eight bars in there as well. So I'm really, really made up with them. Uh, we needed a few more um, kitchen wipes because we continuously keep wiping our kitchen sides down and keep cleaning everything. So yeah, these are the Sparkling Shine range and they get 60 wipes, antibacterial. These are all purpose cleaning wipes. Um, we find it really hard just to find kitchen ones to be honest with you. So these ones, they were quid and then these are the apple fragrance and they were a pound as well i got these and i'm going to take them out with me so and when i go to work and everything they are the antibacterial first aid removes germs ple pleasantly light scented extra large sheets you get 15 in there uh, an effective first defense against germs and disease oh you get 50 in there actually 50 um, toilet wipes. So I'm going to take these out with me so in case I need to use the toilet or in work and everything and give the toilet a clean before I use it. So then, I'm going to say, which, yeah, so really happy with them. I think these are new. Mum went to try them. They are the, pardon me, the Fries Turkish Delight. They were a pound in there. I can't wait to show you the last item. I'm going to save it till last. It's a good one. So then I ran out of these um, um, antibacterial hand wipes. I think these were a pound in there. I get 20 in there because 99% 99 of bacteria. Alcohol free as well. So I don't just use these on my hands. I actually use them that kind of... I, don't know if they're good for your face, but I kind of do use it on my face as well. It's really, really weird just to completely wipe the germs away from everywhere. And I have run out of these like crazy. So yeah, them. And I find stuff out really hard to get at the moment. Then these. Mum could not believe like how much they were for like one little 12. So I, I'm sure these are new out. They're the caramel ones. They literally didn't have hardly any in there left. So these ones, I think they are new them ones they were £1.25 in there in the, so that is quite pricey just for one bar so I picked up two and I hope they're tasty for that price but I did see on Facebook somewhere that um they were new I'm sure I did and with them selling out I'm guessing they're either good or they are new then I got six of these they are so so cool honestly so I love an after eight so, so much, just honestly. And these are perfect mini sizes. You get like four in the box. So, you know, when you open, for me, when I open a huge um, one of them, I'm just going to keep putting my hand in continuously for them. But with these little ones, it's just perfect size for me, even for me to take, you know, if I fancy a little chalky bit of work, my break or something. So yeah, really, really happy with them. I got six of them. I wish I picked up more now. I might pop out to B and M and see if they've got any more. And they were ninety nine p each. Before I move on to my last item, I forgot to show this in my Morrison's haul. So I picked this up for my knee. So it's the Disney Princess Cleansing Hand Gel. That was one pound twenty in Morrison's. I just forgot to show it in there. Then finally. I don't normally buy Lego for myself, really, but I'm trying to get something to distract myself from my phone because I'm on it way, way too much. So I have got loads of the Van Gogh puzzles and stuff I've tried to, you know, get into. They're so, so hard, honestly. Like, my brain has to, it's literally, I have to be in a completely calm zone because, honestly, a thousand piece jigsaw, all, oh god, on anyway, I'm gonna tackle him just to make sure I'm off my phone more. So, I picked this up in there, 
it is the Harry Potter um, Quidditch Mat Lego. So that one. And I'm going to actually do this to uh, stay off my phone because I think this is going to keep me busy and everything. And, you know, I... I I actually am going to start buying more of the Harry Potter Lego, but I don't, when I build it, I'm not going to take it down. I'm just going to leave it up. So I'm, so I'm going to find space somewhere in my room. And this was reduced to £22 in there, which is a really, really good price. Because before I bought it, um, I searched it up online to see how much they were. Because if they were the same price in another shop, then, you know, I didn't have to carry this around with me. So I thought, you know, check it out. They're normally at £35 or so on John Lewis and stuff. And this was reduced to 22 quid. So that's like £13 saving. So yeah, I did, did pick this up. And I cannot wait to give it a go, honestly. It's so, so, so cool. I mean, they did have a... What minute was it? The Privet Drive one with the flying car. But that was 55 quid in there. And then I searched up as well, and that's 55 quid normally in all stores as well. So I left that one. So yeah, that. And that is the final um, item from B&M. So 100% the Lego Harry Potter is my favourite by far. So yeah. Anyway, guys, that has come to the end of this B&M video. Hope you have enjoyed it. Um, if you have, please hit that subscribe button, comment, and give my video a huge thumbs up. And also, I'll link this cap in below. And I'll see you really, really soon, guys, with my next video. Bye.